Okay, this here I've been talking about for a while on, on forums and the people I know who read comic books on a regular basis. I, I don't understand the appeal. Well, I won't say, like, not the appeal. I don't understand the whole glorifying of the Joker. I can understand the Punisher. I can understand Moon Knight. I can even understand Taskmaster and Deadpool. I can understand those those anti-hero type characters, but I don't understand the Joker. The reason why people get Joker tattoos in their body or sport the Joker t-shirts and make their whole room and decorate it in like in Joker memorabilia. I don't understand the whole, the, the love of the Joker. I guess it's like the same kind of, the same kind of appeal a lot of people have towards serial killers. You know, Bundy, Manson, Dahmer, stuff like that. Reason why people get so fascinated with characters like that. And I'm not going to lie. Like, you know, I have an intrigueness with serial killers. Like, I don't understand why they do the things they do. So I always try to under try to figure out and understand why anyone can possibly do something like that to someone else. And that's my whole thing with the Joker also. I don't understand how people love the Joker as much as they do. Do not get me wrong on this. The Joker is a hell of a villain. He's also an extraordinarily, like, crazy concept of a character to create for the Batman mythos. So, having Batman, a stern, steady, like, unmovable type character, he cannot be swayed at all and making that same opposite, but similar character for the Joker as well. The Joker cannot be reasoned or bargained with. We all watched the Batman Dark Knight movie. He cannot be reasoned or bargained with. He does what he does because he is a full-on madman. But so is Batman. So I get the Joker in that aspect. But the reason that people love the Joker so much... I think people get swayed by how the Joker really is. They see him in the media, like in the movies or the cartoon show. <clears throat> And they think he's like a laughable, lovable clown who just does like crazy things. In the comic books, the Joker is anything but that. He is a full-on psychopath, just killer. The dude would kill you just to get a joke, just to get a laugh out of it. Even if no one else gets the fucking humor, he'll kill you for it. I remember I read a story once that the Joker went into hiding and he came back. And when he did... He, he found people all over Gotham. But the people he found all around Gotham, they all had pacemakers inside their body. So what he did was something extremely dreadful. He set all the pacemakers to detonate, but in order. So anyone who named or started with an H, he was killed in first. Anyone named who ended with an A, he killed him also. So anyone who named started with an H and ended with an A, it would make out ha, ha, ha. And he killed about eight people doing this. It's just... The, the genius behind that is grand, but the fact that people glorify some shit like this is crazy. Just absolutely crazy. And I remember reading No Man's Land. I talked about this a lot. If you guys follow me on certain like forums, you know what I'm talking about. The Joker killed... Gordon's wife in No Man's Land. He was he took all the firstborn kids in Gotham City, put them on one area. Gordon's wife found where those babies were, confronted the Joker. The Joker tossed the baby towards his towards Gordon's wife, and when she grabbed it, the Joker grabbed her gun or grabbed his gun because he was pointing a gun at gun at the baby also, pointed a gun at her, and blew her brains out while she's still holding this baby. And then he went and turned himself in. It's just... The people who love the Joker so much, I don't think they read the comic books. Because the Joker is fucking crazy. He's, he's certifiably fucking mad. Just a madman. I don't get it. I don't get the love behind the Joker. I would never understand it. I have a Joker shirt, but I never fucking wear it. Only only bought that damn shirt in the first place because I do... The whole YouTube video things, and I figured that people would like the Joker, but now that I bought it, now that I think about me even buying that fucking shirt, I regret it, and I need to give it away, because I do not want to walk around wearing a Joker shirt. I haven't worn it since I did that video, 
just, ugh. I don't know, maybe just because I have a good nature heart. I don't know. I'm not saying people who love Joker don't have a good nature heart. I'm just saying, like, I've been following capes since I was 12 years old. So my idea of good is is that. That's like that's my epitome of good is being like being like Superman. Superman is the epitome of good. A fictional character is my idea of goodness. I guess I, I don't like to see gray in the world, even though I know it's there. I just try to see the whole black and white that the capes install in people. Watching Game of Thrones changes that real fucking fast, though. But yeah, like, what do you guys think about that? Do you like? Do you understand the whole glorification of people loving the Joker? Do you think like it's crazy that people love the Joker so much? Or do you, or do you like you agree like with love with the love of Joker? Do you have Joker memorabilia all over your home? Hit me up. Let me know what you think, because I really am curious about this. Until next time.